Oh my goodness, it's like Dodge the Shrapnel with these things. They're like everywhere. They're just nuts. They're absolutely nuts. Hello guys and welcome back to the next episode of Astroneer and as you saw in our last episode when we went from zero to space all in one episode we are here on the arid planet. Now I'm not entirely sure how dangerous this place is going to be but we have got the requirements all the stuff here that we need to really get set up. We've got a habitat here which we can place down at any point as well to set up a new base. I'm just wondering if we can go and have a quick look around. <laughs> I don't want to take all of these with me, do I? So, let's maybe swap some of those for some of this composite. I think that would be a good idea. Can we pop some of these? Oh, look, we can even pop these on the side here. That's fantastic. Let's take some of this with me. Put some of those on there. Do you know what would have been really good? If I set that down... Yeah, that is still likely to blow away, I reckon. I don't want to just leave it there. Can I put some of these on here? Oh, that was going to go on there. Oh, excellent. We're going to have another one over here. Just so if I do see some resources while I'm out and about, we'll be able to grab them. What I could do, actually, is just make... Whoa, suddenly a load of stuff just came into focus. If I just do a little hole down here and just drop that in there and just build this up... Okay, I don't think that's going to blow anywhere. That's good. So then I can get rid of these two. There we go. And we can head out. Let's make some tethers. I'm going to try and avoid using too many tethers. Oh, look. There's plants. That means there's going to be lots of research around here. This is... Well, there's like things blowing along. What the heck was that? Are they going to spit at me? I don't think they are. No, we're okay. Look. What are those things? Look, here it is. Come back. Oh, it's gone. Can I grab those things? What have we got down there? That look. Whoa. That looks like a really cool sheltered place to be. Oh, oxygen 50%. Maybe that is where we will set up our base down there. So let me do a bit of exploring and see what we can find. Now let's get some tethers going up here. We don't want too many, but just enough to help us get around. A little bit and have a look. We've got some more. Yep. So it's looking like it's quite windy, this place. But it's not as barren as I thought it could be. There we go. Let's stick another one there. Okay. Interesting. I'm wondering whether we should set a base down under here. It's like underneath the, underneath the overhang. Let's just run this way as well. See what's over here. We've got a oh, we've got a big hole down here going down to a cave. Oh, now this could be cool. Don't fall in. <laughs> I love the way those things are blowing. Oh, that's all mainly outside as well, isn't it? But lots of research to grab there. Okay. Oh, there's some composites, some stuff that we need. Cool. Okay. I'm just gonna have a bit of a wander around, see what I can see. Well, I just got whacked by one of those spiky ball things that gets blown through the air. They actually just kill you to death. Well, I, th I think it sort of half killed me, and then I fell down here anyway, and that was that. So, <laughs> I'm definitely thinking that we need to be making a base underground, because at the minute, this is absolutely nuts. Oh, I kept my solar panels up here when I died. That was interesting, but yeah, I'm trying to look around for... Cool spot. I'm like surfing all over the place. Trying to look around for a cool spot where we can set up a home. And it's, it's actually quite difficult to get around. What is this stuff here? I need to just get back and get some air. That looks like a new resource that I haven't seen before. Let's just run a few tethers over there. Let's connect to that one. Oh, here, come, here they come. Can I put that one down? Is that not going to connect? Here we are. Let's see what this stuff is. It seems to be some sort of resource, but it doesn't have a name. Why am I unable to get that? Interesting. There's a hole in the floor here as well. What is... Ouch. What is this stuff? Maybe I need... Maybe I need the drill to get it. Until I get a full one, I'm not going to know what it is, am I? Cheeky! Let's get some more air. Okay, let's put another tether down here. There we go. Uh, oh, there's some under there. Look, can I grab that? Let's see if we can get a full one out of what's here. 
Ooh, it's actually titanium. Wow. So you can just grab titanium straight out of the ground. Oh my goodness, my oxygen is dropping. Let's connect this up to here. There we go. Let's fill ourselves up. So we can get titanium straight out of the ground. That is fantastic. But when it's in this hard rock here, you probably need to use the crane on it, which would make sense. Oh, here we go. We just cleared out a little space. Oh, there is a cave under here. Oh, no! These things are still blowing in. Oh, man. This is looking... This is looking like a cool place. Wow, there's a... Oh, okay, they're squirting out the gas. Yeah, I don't want to get lost in here. <laughs> Let's head back. Oh, dear. Right, I really need to start setting up my base. And I really need to make sure I don't die. Ah, right, let's get back up here again. Oh, my oxygen is so low. Oh, there we go. Okay, we're sorted. Let's run back up here again. Oh, my goodness. It's like Dodge the shrapnel with these things. They're, like, everywhere. We seriously need to be built underground. And you can't stop them either. They're just nuts. They're absolutely so, nuts. I'm thinking of clearing out somewhere here. I'm going to try and sort of build a way down. Let's see if we can... Let's see if we can go down here. Unfortunately, at the moment, the uh, the terraforming tool seems to be a bit balked. I don't know why. It doesn't do the keep a nice flat path going. There we go. Let's come over here. Like it used to do. I don't know why. Hey! I don't know why it's doing that, but if I can just dig down here, I might just find out. No! There's loads of them stuck <laughs> down there. Look. Should we let them out? It seems like we can... Oh, look, I'm going to just slide straight off there, aren't I? As soon as I, <laughs> as soon as I head down there. Oh, my goodness. But I think down there would be a good idea. If we can sort of get out of the way of all of these things blowing around, that's certainly going to help us. <laughs> look. <laughs> Man, and the windstorms here are absolutely horrendous. I don't want to give up on this planet. I want to set up a working base here. Because I bet there is some cool stuff hidden away down here. But look at this, the visibility. It's worse than the other planets. Oh my goodness. Right, so I've dug down into this little cave under here. And this little cave, let's run along here, just goes on. And on. And on. Oh, there's a hole to the outside there. And on. I don't know how far this is going to go. Let's let's follow it along and see. We are sort of heading down. Let's put that down. Oh, we're going to get a sudden drop off. We are. Man. I mean, this... What's that light over there? There's obviously a hole in the ceiling somewhere. This could be a very cool place to put a base. Because it would mean... There we go. Let's run down here. That we could easily explore down into the caves. Which would be fantastic. Here we go. I'm not seeing any horrible plants and things down here either. But to get a little buggy to go down here, I think, would be really cool. So, yeah, I'll tell you what we're going to do. is We're probably going to try and open up a nice area up here. And set our pod down. And maybe have an underground base. How about that? Something a bit different. There we go. How about a nice room like that just to get us started? I mean, it's not going to be enough room to do all the things we want. But it'll be a good start. Let's see if we can carry the habitat down there. Where is it? Oh, it's in the hole over here, isn't it? Yes, I completely forgot where I put that thing. Can I pick that up out of there? I can. And it'll be interesting to see whether you can still get solar power underground. Oh, no! Don't whack me with that! Let's just pop that down there for a minute. Let's go down here. Those things seem to appear out of nowhere for some reason. So... I'm going to pop this down here. Let's see. And what do we reckon? Can I get that to face towards me? It seems to just face whichever way it wants to. Okay, well, let's set that up here. There we go. Excellent. So that is a good start. And then we can start expanding from here. So I might just dig this out a bit bigger and bring all of our storage down here as well. 
Right, let's get some of the basics up and running. I mean, a trade station would be good. We could immediately start trading things. What I'm going to do, I'm not going to use that cheaty thing I showed in the last episode. We'll use the trade station properly when we want to, but um, I would actually like to get some things done properly. So, let's make a printer. We've got copper we bought for that. Let's turn that round if we can. I wish there was a way to turn these round. Scroll in the middle mouse button when you pick up one of these to turn them round would be handy but if we get a printer going first then we can make a battery start storing power and start doing all of that lovely stuff here we go fantastic power's going to start building up in there and we can start getting some more storage as well in fact i'm going to put that on there and that on there there we go and this is the first thing I want to set up, is a wind turbine, because we're using so much power here. I think they use copper as well, don't they? So, we can make a couple of these. Man, we yeah, we can. We certainly need to get these things going. I don't know whether... Let's have a look. I'm pretty sure that's not going to work underground, which would make total sense. But if we can get that thing up here... Hmm, I'm just wondering... Because we'd have to sort of expand these out to up here to get wind going, wouldn't we? Can we build... Let's have a look. Bom, 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 bom. Can we build off of here? Oh, there's those things flying by again. We can. Okay, so we could put... Oh, wow, look at that planet! <laughs> Whoops. Someone didn't turn the gas off. So if we put some resin onto that. Oh, it's so great coming down here. One, two... Oh, we don't need three, do we? We just need... Well, that's okay. We'll take this with us. Oh, here's some more. How do they get under here? I think these things literally spawn anywhere and then they will despawn. Let's dig that out. They would just randomly despawn as well, so it's worth keeping that in mind. Let's build some more tethers. Okay, let's see if we can... Well, oh, come on. Let's let's get up here. Let's see if we can attach this thing to here. I mean, we're going to have to make sure we remember to detach this when we leave. Let's stick a resin on that. Let's get this ready. Okay, what's going on? Do we need to build... Oh, we need to build out one more. Oh, could we add it on there? Whoa! Ouch! Okay, let's... Before those hit us, let's just jump in here and see whether... That starts kicking in on there. It may be that we do need to add it onto a platform. Yeah, it's not kicking in here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Oh, I'm going to have to climb up here out of the way. I want to be careful not to make my ship sink into the ground. If we face this way, if we set this one off... Oh, it's another blimmin' storm. Can I quickly get that built? No, I can't. I've got to get in. I've got to get in before it gets too dangerous. Okay, the storm has abated. Let's... Oh, no, I don't want to put those on, do I? I want to just put that on there. Let's make a bit of space. Oh, no, there we go. Look, it's, it is. It's adding a whole other one of these. Okay, let's do that. And then that should give us one that will take... the Yeah, there we go. Take the wind thing. Hmm. Interesting to see whether that's actually going to end up kicking in. <laughs> right down here. Or whether I'm going to have to try and get it up high somewhere to get that to work. Because, I mean, look. The, I mean, the weather. <laughs> the weather around here is horrendous. Aha! I've done it. I've managed to lift the thing up. There we go. So these platforms will place, depending on where you're standing. This is dangerous out here at the moment. Um, so if you stand up higher and look down, they will literally step up, as you can see, like that. There we go. So we can now actually remove some of these tethers. I'm trying to sort of keep on top of not having too many tethers around, if we can help it. There we go. So that one can probably reach to there. That one can probably reach to there. There we go. Excellent. That is now making power for us. Fantastic. So we could actually put a few batteries out here because we are going to be making so much power with that window. Look at my goodness me. There's so many of these things. Good grief. And if I walk into those, I'll be done for. Okay, so we're just waiting for the power to build up on here. I'm going to get some batteries if I can. Okay, well that's given us some power for when we're out here connected to our tethers and that sort of thing. I've just moved my solar panels up there 
just to help with that. But at the minute, we're not storing any of the power. We need to get some power to our setup down here. Um, so I've got myself a trade station. Whoa, I've got myself a, a printer. But this, this is all of this isn't, of course, connected by these tethers. This is like a whole separate section down here. So... Um, what I'm thinking of doing is setting up a fuel condenser um, and then we could run this place via coal, which we haven't done before. This is a hole that leads to the outside, by the way, so I'm just closing this off if I can. There uh, we go. Excellent. So I might just do some trading and I'm pretty sure we can trade... There we go. Let's grab some of this. I'm pretty sure we can trade through the ceiling, <laughs> even though there's no... Um, there we go, let's clean that out a bit, even though there's no access to the roof. So what I'm thinking of doing is let's just see what we can do to get some coal. There we go, so if we put some of this on there, are they going to be happy to take... Hmm, I don't know. Some of this compound for coal? Maybe not? Well, it's gone. It went straight through the ceiling. I'm not sure I need to dig away for him to get down, but I think he'll be back in a minute. Let's just clear out a bit more space here. Oh, here he comes. Oh, he's come through the ceiling and we have a piece of coal. Oh, fantastic. Well, let's build ourselves the fuel condenser. Oh, no, hang on. It's not the fuel condenser I want, is it? Well, looking around, I think the easiest thing we're going to be able to do here is to build a little ridge down to here and put our wind farm outside here. Let's have a quick look. This is, this is basically outside and we can see things get blown around quite a lot down here. There's also some organic stuff here. Oh, that would be good, wouldn't it? If we can gather some organics. Is that going to count as organics? Nope. None of that's going to count as organics. Okay. But yeah, if we can do that down here, that would be really handy. The question is, do I have enough resin now that I've built all those other platforms out there to be able to build down to here? If not, we can always do some trading, can't we? Which will be good. <laughs> those things drive me nuts. Okay, let's let's get some of these set up down here. I'm going to try and stand nice and low. So hopefully they will go through the ground. Right, I went out hunting. Got some more of that titanium that we found out there. Let's grab all of these off of here. There we go. Have I got space for these ones? Let's move around this side. Get that platform down there and get that... Oh, backpack is full. And get this thing working. Let's stand down here again so we're nice and low down. And get platform making. Here we go. Yeah, it's coming down. Let's go down with this one. Excellent. Well, I don't know why, but these ones didn't want to build down. They wanted to build out on some nice floating islands of their own. So, I'm thinking, well, if that's what you want to do, then we'll we'll set them up like that then. Because, well, hello. Because why not? We could then have a nice power farm across here. Let's just do one more. Oh, that was going to go down. Probably There's probably some sort of thing. Yeah, look, if the land's near enough, it will go down. And then if we can get a load of wind farm things on that, we'll actually start powering what is going to become our main base. So let's go and grab... I tell you what, on a really windy day, this thing keeps my... Uh, as long as I'm connected to the tethers, it keeps my drill going 100% all the time. It's fantastic. So let's shove that on there. And hopefully... That will kick in on the next one. Oh, come on. <laughs> the wind was coming through here like mad a minute ago. Let's try this one. Yay! There we go. Excellent. Right, I'm going to make a couple more of those. Look at that power flowing through. Here we go. Uh, what does it need? Oh, aluminium. Darn it. I thought we could do that with what we've got. Oh, have we got any aluminium left? We may need to go hunting for aluminium unless I can trade for some. Can I get any? Let's have a look. 
Aluminium. Can I get any with like what I've got? One. We need two, don't we? Oh, I don't really want to use those. I want that for batteries. I might just go and grab some more titanium. And he's back. Right, let's stick these things on here. One there, one there. And then the very next thing I want to make is some generators so we can harness. I'm sure we make it. Look at it spinning around. You can see the shadow. We are making more power than we are ever going to use with wind power on here. Let's pop out and chuck this one down. There it goes. Is that one okay out here? Maybe we need to move that along a bit. I've got to be careful here. I don't want to die. Whoa! Oh, ow! What? <laughs> I'm going to appear here. So <laughs> oh, I'm down here. Why am I under there? Okay, I'm just going to hide underground. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, there I am in the ground. Poor Biffa. Right, let's grab that. Let's take this over here. Let's stick this on the end one there. There we go. Perfect. And then on here, I'm going to stick some solar panels. Go on. There we go. I'm assuming... Can I stick some on the end of these things as well? No, they won't go on there. Okay, that's fine. Or well, we can stick some of it further along. Yeah, they're working. Excellent. Go on. On you go. <laughs> when you're ready. One and two. Oh man, we're getting so much power. That is brilliant. So of course we could make... I think I interrupted myself earlier. I was talking about the coal. We could make the generator here to use the coal. There we go. Just traded some stuff for some more copper. But I really want to make a battery. Depends if we find a lot of coal on this... Whoops, on this planet. I love that 360 it does. If we do find a lot of coal on this planet, then I might make the generator. But at the moment, this battery... Um, I'm going to put the battery out here where we can see it. Maybe just on the end there. There we go. That's going to be filling up with a lot of power from all of those. And that's going to keep us going. So, I think the plan is going to be to get ourselves a vehicle, start looking around outside, and then we can also start exploring. But that's going to be in the next episode tomorrow. Make sure before you leave you hit the big B with the tea stain as that will subscribe you to my channel so you don't miss out on any more Astroneer gameplay, bugs, tips, tricks and all that sort of stuff. I'm determined to bring as much to you as I find out as possible. Thank you very much for watching. Keep all the comments coming. I'm loving it and I will see you guys tomorrow for the next episode. Take care. Bye bye.